One of the difficulties with the, the bike sharing, of course, as you know, is that often you get people that want to ride the bikes to one place, but they don't want to ride them back. For example, if it's a hilly terrain, they're happy to ride it downhill, but they don't want to, especially in the summer, ride it back uphill again. Um, and my sense is that in, in China, the authorities have been a little more tolerant <coughs> of bikes piling up uh, on city streets and not being dispersed in a kind of efficient way than authorities uh, in, in municipal areas in the United States might be. And particularly in, in the US, uh, the bike sharing model is, a, is often a partnering model with the municipal government. Mm -hmm. So in a sense, you've got to get regulatory approval from the partner of your competitor in that local area. How do you, how do you handle that problem? Uh, in actual fact, we consider us as a startup. We need to address the problems when we encounter problems, we shouldn't be fear fear of the problems. In the beginning, they might be the powering of the shared bicycles or the bicycles will be vandalized or damaged by some people intentionally. We have several ways to deal with it. Number one, we need to research on the users' uh, demands and the user behaviors. Why do they damage our shared bicycles? Does that mean that we do not have enough bicycles or just only want to make some intentional damages? Our personal thinking that if the demand is not big enough, how can we meet the user's demands scientifically and reasonably? If they are want to make some damages intentionally, we have a credit system. When users are making use of bicycles, their behaviors will be recorded on the basis of your using experience or user record, we will score and read so that we can regulate our behaviors. If you damage our bicycles intentionally, that means in the future you are not entitled to make use of our shared bicycles. In actual fact, in the foreign countries competition, we needed to communicate with local partners or competitors. We knew that in the US, they are home to a lot of US-based uh, shared biking companies. We might compete against them. But for all four, we want to find our own operational approach and to locate the user's demands more accurately.